Hi, this is Dave from Steel City Jones Flight Academy. Today, we're on location in Waltham, Massachusetts. We've been here all week training their police department on the Matrice 210s and the Mavic 2 Enterprise Dulls. And I thought it would be a really good idea to make a video on discussing what I would consider to be reasonable line of sight versus marginal line of sight at best. What I consider to be realistic line of sight is when you can still see the drone without it being ultra small and tiny. That to me is what I consider to be reasonable line of sight that allow you to be able to see the aircraft, the orientation of the aircraft, and the stability of the aircraft, and the surroundings of the aircraft. That's to me reasonable line of sight. If this aircraft is approximately a thousand feet away, this aircraft's going to look really, really small. It's going to be almost like a dot. With that the case, you're not going to be able to really see the aircraft's orientation very well and really be relying on your video monitor feed to really see what you're doing. And that's not what the FAA really wants you to do. They want FAA wants you to maintain line of sight with the aircraft and as opposed to flying with your monitor. And then you have to ask yourself, well, what happened then if your monitor signal goes out and it's not reliable, then what are you going to do when the aircraft's a thousand feet away? How are you going to get a, be, able, be able to get it back? And many people are not trained well enough to be able to fly it back at far, far distances. So it can be a problem if some organizations are only using this aircraft as their go-to machines and they don't have a larger aircraft. When you have a larger aircraft like the Matrice 210s, now that aircraft at a thousand feet away looks much larger and it's much more manageable under normal flight operations. So a lot of people don't think about that when they're purchasing aircraft. So reasonable line of sight versus kind of questionable on a borderline of sight is definitely a consideration that you might want to consider when you're looking at what aircraft that you buy. The Mavic 2 Enterprise is absolutely a great tool to use. It's a great aircraft. We train them, we sell them, we fly them all the time. But you know, there is, it's a, for a certain application. Whereas the Matrice 200, 210 series, those are for longer flight distances and missions where you want to go 1,000, 1,500 feet away. You need to get little longer distances away. So I just want to explain you know, the differences between the two aircraft and some considerations that you might want to take a look into when you're purchasing one of these. Again, if you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks again. If you like this video and like to see more free videos in the future, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And while you're at it, if you're interested in free lessons on how to fly drones, discounts on drone equipment, discounts on insurance, or access to our exclusive drone video library, check out our website, steelcityflightacademy.com.